Hello beautiful flowers and welcome to my channel. If you are new, welcome and thank you so much for clicking on this video. And if you're returning, welcome back and thank you for your support. I haven't done this in a while, but my name is Michela and on this channel I am working towards um, saving for a down payment on my very first home, hopefully to buy this summer, and just kind of working towards being responsible with my money. So just kind of documenting that journey. Haven't given that intro in a while, so I figured I would. But in today's video, we are going to be budgeting out my very first paycheck of February. This is my paycheck. Um, so if you've seen my budgets with budget with me in the past, you know my paychecks are slightly less than my husband's, which is totally fine. Um, but let's just go ahead and get right into it. All right, so here I am with my weekly budget sheet and this is February number one. And we have all of my categories listed out, my trusty calculator here. <clears throat> so let's just dive right in. So our budgeted amount, and it's really all of these are actual amounts too. I will be stuffing these actual amounts. Um, so my paycheck was 1,133. So finally seeing that raise, um, I don't know why I didn't see it in my second paycheck of January, <laughs> my second paycheck of January, because I should have, but that's neither here nor there. So it was 11.33. Let's dive right into the stuff we know. So rent always gets 220. Utilities, we in the past have only been putting 40. I'm going to start putting 50 in there um, because we all know what happened last month. Phone, 35, always works. Um, subs, I always put 10 for my paychecks. Parking, always gets a $20 bill, and insurance. We are doing amazing on insurance. We are way ahead, so I'm just gonna be stuffing 10. So let's get our total for um, expenses, for bills. So we have 220, 50, 35, 10, 20, and 10, so 345. And if you guys have seen my budget with me in the past, you know this probably, <laughs> is not gonna go well things just don't seem to add up for me especially when we get to the sinking funds i don't understand but i still like to give this the good old college try so <laughs> let's go into our cash envelopes i'm gonna be giving us 80 for groceries this week eating out um gosh this is so tough um let's go with 65 uh, i think yeah 65 Okay, gas. I do not need gas this week, so we're going to do 50 just for Zach because he's most likely going to need it. And then each of our uh, spending for my paychecks, we each get $20. So our cash envelopes are going to be 235 It's kind of nice to be kind of getting a groove for these um, now that we're back to using cash. If you're kind of a newer viewer, I used prop money for a few months and um, just starting towards the beginning of the year here, I started using real cash again. So I've been trying to kind of get used to that. All right, so we have our bills, our cash envelopes. Let's move on to our, this is not debt, um, this is savings. So we do have a few, I'm gonna zoom you guys in a little bit. We do have a few savings categories we know well, actually, our savings card is where we know all of these. So house always gets $100. This is saving for a down payment on our home. Emergency always gets 50. Our 100 envelope. So here are the numbers that we have left for our 100 envelope. Um, I'm so scared. <laughs> I'm always so scared. <laughs> this is my least favorite to pull. The 100 envelope challenge is scary, okay? I only have large numbers left. Oh, 75. We're only doing one, guys. We're only doing one. I got 75, so we're only doing one. All right, our 52 week, this is week number five. All right, our likes challenge. Oh my gosh, you guys, for the millionth week in a row, I did not charge my iPad and I film with my phone and my phone is how I check. <laughs> so I'm gonna have to get my phone off the, the little stand here and check my likes here in a second. Our monthly challenge, we do have a new monthly Oh no, I just dropped a binder. All right, we do have a new monthly challenge. This is from Breezy Budgets Shop, um, which is Brianna Life and Budgets on YouTube. Um, this is a really, a really, really shrunk down Valentine's Day, um, $50 savings challenge. 
Uh, it's, it says it's Galentine's Day. Oh, can you even see that? Sorry. It's Galentine's Day, or should I say Nomlentine's Day? <laughs> oh my god, you guys. It's late. It's late for me. Anyway, so this will save us 50 bucks throughout the month. Um, I'm just gonna do... Let's do a 15. We'll do a 15 this week. All right. So that's taken care of and our weight loss. I lost two and a half pounds this past week. I am so excited about that. So we do... Here's the one I keep track of during my budget with me. And I have a little, I have a smaller one that goes in my um, actual binder. So we lost two and a half pounds. So it's $5 per pound. So that is $12.50. I'm just going to round up to $13. So we are going to be putting $13 into our weight loss challenge. That is so exciting. Ooh, I love it. Losing so much weight. It's great. Okay, so let me really quickly take my phone off the stand and check our likes. All right, you guys, well, I was just talking to myself for 10 minutes without pressing the record button, so that's great. So let me just run by you what I did. Our likes challenge ended up having 35 likes, um, so that brought our total of our savings category to $293. I then decided to add the minimum of $5 to each of our travel envelopes because we have eight envelopes, so eight times five is $40. And then I went through my, <laughs> this is a recap, real quick recap of what I did. Um, I went through my long-term savings, or sorry, my long-term sinking funds binder to go through my trackers that I fill out each week. You know, like baby gets one, you know, electronics has a tracker. And I went through and I filled out everything. So basically sinking funds are getting $220 <laughs> and everything added up. Oh, I wish you guys could have been there to see the glorious moment. Of course the moment, of course the time that I actually get it right. <laughs> the first the time that I actually get it right where I don't have the incorrect calculation, I don't record it. You know, this calls for a glass, this calls for a drink of wine. <sighs> Y'all, oof, might need another glass, to be honest, might need another glass. But anyways, um, so yeah, sinking ones are getting 220, but I will, go ahead and calculate everything together for you to see this glorious moment. So our bills got $345. Our cash envelopes are getting $235. Our sinking funds are getting $220. Our savings are getting $293. And our travel binder is getting $40. And that totals up to $1,133 which is what my check was. I am so incredibly proud. I wish you could have been there to see it the first time I got it right, but <laughs> it is what it is. Um, you know, maybe that's nice. I had that me, my personal, my personal moment where it was just me talking to myself, getting it right. So anyways, <laughs> I think it's time for me to go to bed, you guys. Um, that is all I have for you today. Thank you so much for watching this budget with me. If you like what you saw, hit that subscribe button and I will see you in my cash stuffing. Bye-bye. <laughs>